What's going on guys, it's Max here from XGO Gameplays bringing you another team of the season player review and this time it is on the cam centre mid centre forward Marek Hamsik. Absolute beast guys, best attributes towards his game are definitely his shooting and his passing. So let's get straight in, he's got 95 ball control, 89 crossing, 94 curve, 91 dribbling, 93 finishing, free kick accuracy very good as well at 86, heading accuracy is good at 87, long passing as well, absolute beast around that middle of the park guys and he'll be popping passes and shots for fun, he's always making space, that's probably one of the best things about this guy, he's not the fastest but we'll, we'll check those stats in a sec, 96 long shots guys, 96 penalties, 96 short Short pass, his, par uh, his shot power is 93. His standing tackles are 82, but he's a cam, so it doesn't really matter. And his volleys are 94. He's got a four-star weak foot and three-star skill moves. And he's from Slovakia, like I said. He's got a high attacking work rate, medium defensive, so that's really good for, really good for a cam. Because you don't want him chasing back and always being out of position when you need him most when you're attacking 86 acceleration 86 agility his balance says 65 guys but i honestly wouldn't believe that as long as he, i really can't talk today along with <laughs> along with his strength at the bottom it just doesn't really matter guys this guy is good enough to beat players and you most likely will enjoy him it's just a shame about his price because wesley snyder probably is pretty much i know wesley snyder's not in Serie A now but i was comparing him to him probably those two players exactly sort of the same you can pick up like marquisio as well who's well, we're not talking about those guys. We're talking about Hamsik. He's got 99 reactions, 85 jumping, 82 sprint speed, 99 stamina as well. His attack position is really good, 85, and his vision is absolutely immense, guys. Don't even listen to that. I reckon he's got 99 because he can pop a pass all day long, which you will see in the clips very shortly. Right, so here is the squad, guys. Hamsik is playing on a 3-5-2 formation for Syria A, and I've got some pretty beast players around him for the cheap price as well. This team is absolutely ridiculously good, and it's so cheap to use. So getting straight into it now, Hamzik guys is an absolutely beast player. His price is a bit ridiculous at the moment, but that will go down. Hopefully if he drops below 200k, I'll actually think about getting him myself. I've got to say a big shout out to Mr. Panda, FIFA Panda, what am I on about? FIFA Panda, Mikkel, you know who you are. Thank you for letting me let me do a player review on this player. Hamsik's passing is absolutely amazing guys on the card it says 91 and I absolutely believe that it's probably even higher and some of the passes he done for me were actually incredible I'll show a few of them in this in these clips he scores a few weird goals as well I don't even know what's going on his finishing is absolutely insane as well I must say I do like him um, the only must doubts I had about him at the start the first four or five games I played with him he was really really inconsistent and I don't know what that is I don't know whether it's to do with like actual team of the season players I find there's so many out there. I've used a lot of team of season players where it says on the stats like 90 shot, 90 passing, and it's like, nah, you're definitely nothing like that. But this guy is, this guy is definitely lives up to his stats because he the pace doesn't even lie. He does have 82 pace because if anyone's thinking 82 pace is meant to be rapid, then it's not. It's all down to his acceleration as well. He beats quite a few players in some of these clips, gets forward whenever he can with his high attacking work rate. Absolutely, good. he's brilliant on the ball. I must say, he he, he skins players for fun makes me laugh sometimes is he as good as he looks and I've already mentioned that inconsistency he makes great runs down the center of the park and always available that's one thing I do like about this guy he's so good on the ball you if you, if you are good with tricks you may be able to use him but obviously he's limited because he's only got a free star and I also know Hamzik had an upgrade on previous FIFAs and he's been an absolute tank. This one definitely lives up to those other upgrades and informs or team of the seasons because he's just he, he, he puts the ball in positions and look here, he just skins out a player and threads it through like a boss. Anyway guys, I just want to say, is there any other videos that I could upload to YouTube or any of you guys want to see in our live streams, do something new or I don't know, just try anything. Just let me know in the comments below. You can follow us on Twitter, it's XGO Gameplays, or even head over to Twitch, that's where I do the live streaming, and obviously you can check us out there. I'll be back on the 6th of June for you guys that are actually wondering. But to sum up, Hamzik as an overall player, he's an absolute beast. Wait for him to go down in price though, definitely guys, because he's going to keep going down. And as long as new team of the week two and team of the season players are coming out, I'll be happily reviewing them for you guys if that's what you want to see so as far as that i'm gonna quickly shoot off now and go make some other videos don't forget to check out the next wager i actually have against Bateson because i know i uploaded one the other day i actually played him for 200k and it is quite an interesting one guys so be sure to check that out and i will see you soon maybe in the stream peace guys bye bye